What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of Supermarket Simulator. Last episode, we finally introduced some mods to this game and I am super stoked. It's put a whole brand new life into this game and I am loving it and I hope you guys are too. If you guys are, be sure to smash that like button. Show it some love and support. If you guys are new around here checking this out, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below so you guys don't miss out on any videos that we're doing here. But um, we're going to continue things here off today with um, paying our bills, getting some stuff ordered, and then we are going to actually get um, the new new growth expansion done here as well. So we're going to go ahead and order this stuff real quick because I don't know exactly what we still need. So we're going to make sure that we get everything that we need and keep on rolling from there. But so we need some chicken legs, need some toilet paper, some cleaner, some bleach. But yeah, if you guys missed last episode, you actually missed quite a bit. So definitely go back and watch that before you check this one out. And uh, come right back onto this one then because we have done a lot um, with the uh, the mods and stuff. It has put a whole new life into this game and it is absolutely amazing. So thank you all very much for the love and support you guys have been showing this series. I wish we had this, these mods for the live stream because that would have made that live stream so much more seamless. Um, here last night at the time I'm recording this. I'm recording this on Saturday as well just after the last couple episodes. And um, this is absolutely amazing though. There we go. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that. Like I said, if you guys missed the mods or missed the um, like mod introduction of this, you guys actually missed quite a bit to it. So like I said, go back and watch that video. Why can I not? I didn't even open this up or I didn't even put place it on shelves. What is up with that? I can't even put this one down now. I need to literally put it down here. Grab... Can I? No, I can't even set that one down. I need to get rid of one out of here. Or one out of the shelf. Put this guy back here. And then so what I'm going to do then is get one out of here. Throw away this box. Yeah, this this bug with this really needs to get fixed. Because especially with now, now with this, because we are doing a lot more with trying to shuffle on boxes at that point with that but that's it is what it is it's all right let's that's occupied by restocker i just need to avoid opening up the boxes i guess that's going to be the biggest thing with that like look at this it's so glorious though what we can do and how quickly we can accomplish all this stuff now there we go we got this occupied by restocker we can get that set right there any sushi sold we're still waiting on oh is he Really, sir? You couldn't grab one of the large, you grabbed like three of the small. Alright. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, we're going to get the next bit of growth. We have enough money still. We are going to go ahead and do that. Uh, let's let's go ahead and do that. So it's sixteen five for that. Leaves us with about $1,000. And look at that. Now we've got even more growth, even more expansion for the store. We can keep moving these back now and have them looking good. Like this. Eventually we're going to reorganize the store too. Um, with all of this, but... Uh, Wait, why did that? Why is it ending up so far? Oh, you know what? Because it's off, it's off the back wall because of that. That's right. I forgot I kept it off because of that little bump out there. Which actually, I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna stick with that because it is actually nice having these all lined up like this. There's that. Let's get. Oh, we're just short of being able to throw that down. That kind of sucks. There we go. Let's get this guy moved over. Like this. And there we go. We're, get, we're gaining even more even more space. We could add a couple more shelves here if we need to. But like I said, I kind of almost want to use this new space to move some of this down a little ways. At least these two aisles and we can make some more room for, um, for our checkouts. Something kind of like that. I think it looks pretty good. Oh, I'm going to need to actually move this one first. Like this. There we go. Come on, baby. There we go. Okay. And then I can move, place this guy right here. There we go. Yeah, it still leaves us plenty of space here of walking around, and then we can get these two, these shelves bumped out as well for all of this. Do something like something like that. Let's move this guy over. That leaves us again with plenty of space over here still. We might even honestly be able to get the next expansion this episode. We will see. 
on this, but this stuff can help with our progress in this game and everything, and it is looking so good. I'm loving it. And I hope you guys are too. Like I said in the last episode, if the mods are too cheesy, too cheaty, le drop me a comment, le let me know, because I'm not too sure what you guys all think of this. It's definitely, um, it is a bit cheesy, cheaty, but it's making this game so much easier to play. It's such a nice quality of life um, update for the game. Or I shouldn't say update, but just different uh, change to the game for sure. Okay, if we haven't... Yeah, there we go. I was going to say, if we haven't sold any sushi yet, I was going to be a little salty there. But we need to get some products ordered. So let's get some of this, some of this. I just love this, so we can just cycle through this. Like I said in the last episode, this is this is something that's going to be coming to the game very similar to this, the vanilla version of the game. So I don't feel too like cheesy cheaty about all of this, which is with the inventory count. It's just something that's not in the actual base game yet. So it it's something that I really enjoy and having, and it's making things so much easier for us. So I want to keep keep using it for sure, at least with this. I think if we were to get rid of the mods, as far as like the stocking stuff, I would be okay with that. But um, just having that alone um, is so much nicer. Like, this is a little bit cheesy cheaty, but, um, like I said, I, so I'd be okay with getting rid of that, but it's just, as far as, like, the inventory thing, I for sure want to keep that. Same with, like, the getting rid of the maximum order size of 10. That's, that's another huge quality of life thing that I really do not want to get rid of. So if we keep any mods, it's going to be, like, the inventory thing and the, how was, oh, was it, this was occupied by Stalker, that's right. And then we got some orange juice. This was the one that was full. Okay, so we got 10 left there. Can we... I think that's our problem too is we're oops trying to box this up and then try can we throw this up here and then if we grab it again no it won't let us okay that's all right just going to use this right here we're going to try and get rid of oh there we go perfect okay i need to move these counter these checkout counters over asap and i'm trying not to affect our customers in the store by doing that so there's that there's that and there we go that is looking good now there is also another mod, too, where we can... I think our stockers can work after midnight. Or, I'm sorry, after 9, after we're closed. But, um, honestly, we're doing okay. Just letting the store run, basically, 24-7 as it sits. is actually fairing us pretty well, I would say. We could get another shelf right here as well, also. But, uh, I'm probably just going to keep bumping this. Just get our next growth, honestly. Before we order any more stuff. That's what we need, basically, is just... The growth, we're waiting on our next licenses for our level, which we're a quarter or so of the way through 49, so we're still a little bit of ways away from that. But um, obviously we've got all of these to get caught up on, which we're about to unlock section 13, so we need to unlock four more sections to get actually caught up on things where we're at, where we should be at with all of that. But we need some lights too. Need to get a couple more of these in, which honestly I probably could just get rid of some of these and rearrange them, but I don't know. We'll see. There is also another mod, too, for more storage room space, which I'm considering doing, but we'll see. I don't know. Yeah, I think I'm going to set this guy, like, right over here, and then we can maybe do the other one, like, right here. I'm going to close that down. I don't know. I think that that would kind of work. And then we just have this space, rid, rid of this space over here. Or, I don't know. I would like to get one more expansion here so we can push these over and then we could do maybe like a two by two for the registers. But I don't know. We'll see. Or maybe we just get rid of this fourth register altogether and just move this guy, move our other uh, Timmy over here. I don't know. I'm trying to make some more space over in here too. We're getting a little, and it's still like pretty tight in here. So maybe, yeah, you know what? Let's get rid of this. We're just going to open it up more, have more, have some more space for three registers and we should be good at that point do it that way like i said once we get all of our customers out of here before we start the day we are going to rearrange these a little bit and um, i just don't want to mess anything up with where they're at at the registers we only have a few more people to get through so we'll be okay with that yeah we got just three more people here which she's almost finished up she's got quite a few items still and she's got quite a few items so it'll be just a minute here but that's all right Our Jimmies are probably like having a freaking heart attack right now. They're just con they've been running twenty four seven. 
straight since we opened up the store here with the mods and everything. <laughs> haven't gotten a break and haven't gotten I haven't haven't slept or eaten in two in two weeks. Okay. She's checking out right finishing checking out right now. We should be good to go. We have forty five hundred dollars even after spending almost seventeen grand just on that. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> We're minus thirteen on that, but that is okay. So we got chocolate bars, ham, and dishwasher tablets. Uh chocolate bars, ham, dishwasher tablets. Uh, we'll go 375, I guess. Dishwasher tablets. I don't know which one they are. Could be that one or it's... Yeah, it's this one. Okay. Let's go, I guess... We're going to go 18 on this because it is pretty expensive. So 75 cents over is not that much. And then we got ham. Don't know if it's that. Okay, I'm going to find out which one it is. So I actually don't know. Um, so it is this ham. Okay. Which, honestly, we're sitting pretty good at that price right there. But alright, let's get these guys moved over just a little bit. We're going to bump him over to here. Kind of like this. Something like that. We're going to move him over here. Oh, actually, that's a little stupid. They're having him right in front of the door. Something like that. I don't think that's terrible. Kind of nice and wide open. A little bit tight, I guess, right here still. Maybe we'll bump him back just a little ways. Kind of like that. That way it gives, us enough, gives all of us enough walking space around. I like it. I think that's good for now. I know, like I said, we're not really, I guess, optimizing space, but that is okay. At that point. we got plenty of space to walk around now. That's kind of the name of the game at this point. Get the store open back up. Let's get our bills paid right away so we don't forget about that. Let's keep on rolling with the market. Getting these orders placed. Here we go. We got all of this. Let's get all of that. Okay. Oh, we actually need quite a bit here. That is alright. We got quite a bit of money at the same time. Yeah, look at this. I mean, we have 30, almost 30 items in this order. We're going to have over 30 by the time we're done with it, for sure. It's just so nice. Yeah, if there's any other mods that you guys want me to check out, like I said, drop me a comment down below, too, because holy crap, look at... <laughs> oh, boy. That is just so epic. We definitely waited too long to order stuff. Now we get all these items to get uh, picked up. I can see the items like teleporting over to the to the storage room. It's a little little interesting. <laughs> Got this box all the way over here. Okay, and that is basically that already. We're pretty much stocked up for the day, at least the start of it. So that is awesome. Where are we sitting at then? Another toilet paper. Another bleach. Um, more pasta elbows. Some more cheese parmesan. Some honey. Some more chocolate. Got some cakes. Some more milks. Some more salt. Some more peanut butter. And some more bread. There we go. Got all that delivered. Let's get all these put on the shelf. Occupied by restocker. Okay, they're definitely getting bro more broken now. Because that was not happening before. Alright. There's all that. Let's again check it. That's the name of the game. Just keep double checking after we order. Should be good. Uh, some more chicken. Do we really want to order? Yeah, we probably do. We're, we're getting down on those. Let's see the... The actual um, shelf count out in the store. I mean, this is honestly a little bit more realistic to, as to what you would have in a real grocery store. Having access to like an inventory count like this. So, I don't feel too too bad about it. it. Definitely, it's a little cheesy. But, like I said, it's actually pretty realistic. I mean, you're going to have like a live inventory count of where you're at with your items in your store. And same with your... Um, 
Same with what you have in the... In your, like, storage room. Okay. Now this box is full. I don't think we're going we're gonna to be able to get all the items out of there. Unfortunately. Yeah, it's going to be just a little bit short, but that's okay. We'll get it taken care of. But yeah, look at this. We get all this nice new space now, too. I know it's a little bit much, honestly, for space. We could probably add in another, like, row of shelves to the aisle there and then move, rearrange these a little bit. But what I would like to do, like I said, is like a two-by-two, two, I think, with this for the, for the register. So we just need that final expansion, final growth for that, which I think is about 20,000 for that, isn't it? Yeah, 20,100. So we're going to need that to uh, get everything taken care of with that. Um, could use more rice, some more pasta elbows. We're not getting the sushi because we already have enough of that. Some eggs, dishwasher tablets, some bleach. And that's, that's all pretty good for now. Got 3,000 bucks still. There we go. Look at that. Okay. I like the sushi we can get up there, so that's good, finally. That's looking good. I mean, the money's just rolling now at this point. We are just flying through all of this. This is so awesome. I love this. Okay. Ah, that's good. Love me some good coffee. Okay. Need some more coffee again. Actually, speaking of coffee... <laughs> Need some more coffee, some more candy. What else? I wish we could just, like, filter by red. That would be nice. It would just populate the area, or populate the screen with what is red only. Or even yellow, or any anything at that point. But I know it's all part of the mod with that, so we're not able to at that point. That is okay. So there we go. You get all that. Rack is full. I don't know why we just ordered more large when we only just got it on the shelf, I think. Rack is full. Okay. We got some hummus over here. Let's see what we can do with this. Try and get this all stocked on up. Um, so we're missing... Yeah, we're just going to have to empty this out then. Oh, okay. That actually, that actually will fully drain us of those. There is that. Let's get this thrown back on the shelf and get that thrown up there. There we're good. We're good with that. Uh, we got some more small sushi. Are we actually? Is our shelf? It's saying the rack is full. Oh, it is. What? Oh, he just he just put it back. That's why. Okay. Uh, we got two left in here. Can we get these stocked out? No. What we can do is empty this shelf out. Like that. And then, can I... No, I can't set that down, of course. Oh, okay. Of course, they just... Just came and grabbed it right when I... Right when I did that. But that's okay. No other sushis that we can do quite yet. We need to empty out... And hope that they're going to grab this other box so I can just stack this up here. And there we go. Okay. We just need one more sushi sold. And then we can empty out that box and actually get it to where we need it. So yeah, we should have nine left once he puts that box out. Yep. Okay. Honestly, the... Maybe what we'll do here, actually, is move this down, and then we'll set this guy up. Oh, that's right. We can't we can't change the label on that. That is actually really nice. But yeah, I think the large sushi is one of the things that we need to double up on, since um, there's not that many that can fit in the box. The checkouts are full. Okay. Hmm. I really don't want to put this out here. But I guess I'm going to, at least for now, we'll help them out. Oops, not 50. 20, 30, and 6. There we go. 
Alright, they're all piling over here now. Okay, I'm gonna try to get you guys through, out of here, in and out of here as fast as we can with this. So you can have a nice night, enjoy your day, the rest of your day, what's left of it. 55, 45, there you are, ma'am, have a nice night. The good thing is we can just take the register down, pick it up when we don't want it, instead of just closing it too. I don't know, we'll see. 28, 75, there you are, ma'am, have a nice night. Get a bunch of stuff coming through here. Uh, 50 cents back for you. There we go. I think that was basically everyone that was stuck um, saying the registers are full. 120.65. Imagine just being in a grocery store and they just pull out a register out of out of thin air, out of a box that doesn't even fit in and put it out for you to come check out. Okay, I'm trying to get on top of the monitor. There we go. Okay. There we go. That is looking really good. Let's see here what we got. Got some more coffee. Got some more toilet paper, some more dish soap. Got some of this. There we go. We got some of that. A little bit of everything, basically. Not quite everything, actually, but a little bit of things. Got some more chicken, got some Parmesan cheese, some to more toilet paper, some yogurt, some chocolate, candies. Got some more peanut butter, some more coffees. Jeez. Okay. I really wish we could order stuff after nine. That'd be nice. Okay, we got a couple more people still checking out here. Got two waiting here, two waiting there. We got her finishing up right there. Come on, people. Got a few more items to go through, and then we'll be good to go for the day. Okay. Got a couple more bags of potatoes going out. Holy crap, sir. How many potatoes do you need? <laughs> Got quite a lot there. And I'll be right back, guys. I'm going to get a refill of my coffee mid-episode here. I want to keep on going. We're only at 20 minutes. For this episode, so like I said, I'll be right back. We're gonna holy crap, 78 customers. Holy crap. No wonder why we went through so many items. Cereal, cereal, and flour. I'm gonna get these adjusted real quick. Now we'll go 350 and then two cereals we need to adjust. Oh wow, this one went way up. Go 560 on that. There we go. Okay. Like I said, I'm going to go grab a refill on coffee real quick. I'll be right back, guys. I know uh, we're, we're just going to cut. If for whatever reason I accidentally forget to edit the cut, I will try. I shouldn't, shouldn't forget on it, but if I do, I'll be right back here in just a moment, and you guys can skip ahead if I don't. Okay, guys. I am back here. I actually took like a 10-minute break and um, trying to let the store finish up for the day, and I actually kind of expected our stockers to be done, and they are still just rolling through with this night. It is actually a little bit insane. Or wait, no, it's the... Uh, what am I thinking? It's the morning time. That's right. But they are... Like I said, I still took like a 10-minute break. And um, they are just absolutely kicking butt through the... Through the morning. So it is actually kind of crazy how much stocking we have to do here. But uh, we're going to go ahead and get... That's right. I placed... I placed that... Or I set that up to be ready for the morning. And um, obviously we couldn't place it at the, at the end of last night. With it being after 9. We're going to go ahead and get all of these in here. With that. It said occupied by restocker. Okay. That's alright. We'll get that taken care of in just a moment. We'll get all the rest of these stocked in. And then we should be good. Yeah. It just goes to show like how many items we actually got down on. But I don't know. Maybe we'll need that mod to increase the uh, stocker speed. We will see. We need, like, a uh, pumping sim with the upgrades for the employees where they're just, like, literally just, like, full-on sprinting around everywhere <laughs> with everything. Okay. And we still need a bunch of stuff in here. This is where this mod is. these mods are actually so crazy because it, like, it just goes to show, like, how much you actually sell through each and every day and what you all need. 
for everything. So it is so nice having having access to this. Just an absolute game changer. Okay. So there is all of that. Let's get this going right here. I haven't been paying attention to how much we're actually spending basically on all these items as well, which almost two grand just for that. <laughs> it is so crazy watching everything just falling from the sky. I guess I can maybe understand a little bit why the devs do only have a cap of 10, but it's so nice not having that cap. Occupied by the restocker. Okay. We'll come back to that. I think whenever the stockers just have any boxes or anything, they just automatically can't be stocked in it, which like I said is good. It keeps it from breaking the game. There might be a config file that I could adjust with that, which I don't know. Maybe we'll, we'll see about that. I might, but it's kind of nice at the same time just to, all, I have to do, all we have to do is just set it off to the side and it's still good to go. We'll just, we'll just come back to it later on and traditionally we're ready to go with it. Oh, sir, don't run me over. <laughs> I'm just trying to grab all my boxes that are piled out in the street here. Okay, let's get these in. Rack is full. There we go. Any others? No. No. No and no. Okay. Let's see what we got with these then. We got, really, two left. Okay. We should be able to at least empty out one of these boxes at the very least. I also need to get some of this stuff moved around. Where oh, are there cereals right here? I, ju I should just switch these racks around. That's all I actually have to do. So I'm probably going to do that here in just a moment. Let's go ahead and get this. Hopefully they're going to come grab this box in a minute. Can I? No, I can't. Okay, hopefully he should be grabbing the box here right now. No? Sir? Sir? Jimmy? Jimmy, come back! <laughs> okay. Really? I guess I didn't need to empty out fully. All I needed was... Wait, Jimmy, are you coming? No? Jimmy? Jimmy! Come back! Baby, come back! You can blame it all on you! <laughs> okay. I am just gonna grab this box in our own then. Because... Screw waiting for, for our Jimmy. Come help. Come bail us out. Even though it's their job to stock. There we go. That goes belongs there. That belongs there. I'm gonna switch these, switch these racks around real quick, actually. Before I get sidetracked and forget about that. So let's move that right there. And then we're going to move this guy right here. It just makes sense being together. That's originally why we placed all these items here like that. Was to be together. So we need to make sure that they stay that way. There we go. Okay. Much better. We got some more cereal here. Let's see. What do we got? We got three in there. We got one left in here. Can we get this just emptied out? Just like that. No, we can't, of course. Okay. So we need to bump that down by two so we can get rid of this other box here with two in it. I'm just going to set that guy right there, I guess. And then we'll bring this guy over here and get these stocked on up. And there we go. Just like that, we got that fixed already. Set that guy down right there. And there we are. Cancel that. That is so nice. I absolutely love these mods. They are just such a game changer at this point for the game. It is so nice. We need two out of here. Um, which actually, I don't even need to do... Empty that out. All I need to do is just grab this other box. Which I can't even because this... Eh. Set that up there. Go ahead and grab this and then we can just get this box emptied out. There we go. Okay. So there is all of that. That's why I can't even do any kind... Nope, oh, there it is. Wait, actually, I want to put the full box first and then this one. That's why I can't even do any cashiering, because we're trying to do all this still organizing with stuff, which I guess I'm just, it's my fault for ordering. Not necessarily too much, it's just the orga organization of the boxes at that point. How many of these do we need? We got two extra here. Um, Actually, you know what? I can just leave that alone. And can I set this down? No, of course I can't. Okay. There we go. Yeah, it's nice having some walking space here finally too with the expansions that we've done now. Actually, let's get this guy placed in here first and there we go. Now we're looking good. Okay. Uh, Salt is too expensive for you, sir. Well, you need, shouldn't be looking to buy it then. 
That's a bit pricey, I guess, honestly. We'll go to 35 for that. Drop it down just a little bit here for you. Appease you, make you happy. Alright, we got some coffee. We got some ham pastry. We got some of this. I don't need to remember the names of things either now, too. We can just go, again, just cycle through the list. And that's all we need to do. It is so nice. I am absolutely just in love with these mods. Uh, we got some tuna. Some of these. Some tuna. There we go. Oh, we got a lot of items here. Can I get this order before nine? Yeah, we can. And explode box explosion. Oh my god. Occupied by restockers, so we'll come back to that. Rack is full. Rack is full, that's alright. Rack is full. Got one box over here. Anything over here that's lingering? I don't think so. No. We're good. We're just going to stand out in the middle of the street here. Get some boxes moved over to our storage room. Oops. Okay, good. I can still put it down even with, after opening it up. It seems like that's the thing that breaks it with these right now. Is by opening it up. And we got this right there. So I think this is the one Yeah, that was occupied. Occupado. Rack is full. We got some more water. Let's get that down. Rack is full. We got some chippies. There we go. Still full. We got a bunch right there. Okay. Occupied by restocker, so where's he at with it? I think we're all right. Yeah, let's just throw that in there. We're, we're good with that, I think. I think that's the box right there, actually. Um, is Yeah, that's obviously full. We don't have very many left of that. Holy crap, we got a lot of people in here. I think that's why we ended up with 70 plus people in that last one, was because we had, um, so, we had so many registers going at that point. Can I? No, of course I can't. Why would I be able to? Okay. There's that. Let's go ahead and grab... Actually, again, we're going to set the full box up here. Move that there, and there we go. We're good to go. Cancel that. Since we don't be, we won't be needing that where we're going. Got some more milk. You know, actually a full box right here. Okay. We're able to just grab it and stock it, actually, for them. Help them out. We honestly can almost use more stockers at this point. It's that crazy. And, of course, I'm trying to get the full box at the bottom where it's not going to be grabbed. There we go. Let's cancel that if I can. Thank you. And then we've got some of these chips to go out. Which, is that the full box? Yeah, it is. Okay. And of course, I can't do that. Why would I be able to? It seems like every box now is just broken completely. There's no chance in saving them. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna. I look at the lighting too. That ugh, that really bugs me having that like real dark lighting there off in the on the toilet paper. Some good old coffee. I love that. All right, we got a few more people checking out here for the rest of the day, and then we'll be good to go at that point. I didn't realize we we're at level fifty now, so that is awesome. We need to get. Guess some more things ordered here, as always. That's the problem is I can't have another... I honestly can't even be running a register at this point in time. Because we're just selling through so much stuff. I don't know, I guess maybe... Maybe we should just try running through the register. Maybe we'll set up a register here tomorrow. We're going to get everything stocked up before the start of the day. At least ordered um, before the start of the day. That's another thing too, like just having that, without having that cap, we can order as, or set set up as much as we need to before the end of the night is over and then order in the morning and get it stocked up right away in the morning and then we're good to go at that point. So that's it, like I said, a huge addition to the game just with that alone on that. 
but okay. Yeah, I like having these shelves side by side again. Definitely a very nice, nice feature with that. I need to probably just move these now. Get these all with the baking stuff and everything and should be good at that point. There we go. Let's go ahead and end off our day. Let's see how many people we got. 75. I think we're just getting a lot more now with the net, with that last expansion that we got. So we got coffee, we got rice, and ham pastry. Um, I think it's that one. Yeah, it is. So we got coffee, I think it was... Wait. Oh. <laughs> I, think it, I think it's that one, definitely. Yep. I'll go 11 on these. And then ham pastry it was. Which I think is... Oh, it's definitely this one. Okay. Perfect. Let's get some lights on here. What I'm going to do here is we'll get our order placed right away. We're going to get our bills paid before we forget. And then I'm going to set up our other register here, which actually I'm going to set that up right now while, while we wait. We're going to try to run through some customers. Get them all nice and checked out. I don't know why I just ran that way. But there we go. Okay, let's grab this guy. There we go. Alright, there we go. So we got all of that. Let's see, where are we at with the milk? We're at seven. And we're completely full on that, so we can't do anything with that. So we're just going to sit and chill at our register, I guess, at that point. Now we got, they can at least line up down here kind of with all of that. So we should be okay. I know I'm not a big fan of having it here, a place like this, because it does kind of get in the way um, temporarily until we get the next growth, which is going to be 20 grand. So we need quite a bit of money still, but uh, we're doing okay. We're definitely, we're making some money, keeping things flowing. So that's really nicely. I definitely just almost spilled coffee on this white shirt. <laughs> that would have been very bad. For that okay so i guess i'm just going to keep ordering sitting back here chilling ordering stuff until we actually need to hop on the register and then we'll we'll just leave it open and hop on it oh speaking of that how you doing there sir uh we got no change needed okay let's again we're just gonna hop back on the register or hop back to ordering stuff and then we should be okay Uh, what else do we need here? There we go. We got some of that. We're good on milk. I'm going to do this real quick. I'm just going to place this order. They can wait just a moment and they'll be fine. There we go. We got 7200 bucks still. How you doing there, ma'am? Got some of this for you. No change needed. Beautiful. That's what we love to see. We got some sodas, some salmon. I think there was some alcohol in there. At 59.85. There you are, sir. Have a nice day. Oh, I was in there trying to jump over the register, and we were on the register still. Okay. Occupado. Occupado. That's all right. Okay. Let's get. Which one is this? This is the green one. Yes, it is. Okay. And then we got some orange flour. We got plenty of space up here, so let's go ahead and do that. Any milk that we've sold? I just saw someone complaining about something too expensive. But we have sold some milk, so we can get that out of there. There we go. I think a bird just like flew up to my window. We have like we have like a big hawk and some pigeons that fly around the apartment sometimes, and they literally will come up and sit on the window ledge, like right outside the window. It's actually kind of crazy. Wow, man, what are you doing with all that TP? Are you stocking up for the next apocalypse? Okay. Yeah, honestly, we can kind of just jump back and forth. Keeps us busy. Um, Actually, I'm not going to order that because we don't need that. I don't know why that's showing up. We have plenty of that. Uh, We got some of this, some of this, some of this. Don't know if we actually need any of that, but I'll just order some, I guess. There we go. We got that ordered now. Let's get our all of our people checked out here. Getting some people lined up. 
So this will help us towards our progress of getting our next cashier, our fourth cashier, which obviously we're going to need at some point here soon enough. Sooner than I thought with how much we have going through now. Oh, wow. There's a lot more for you there, sir, than I thought. An 84.55. Thank you, sir. Got a couple of six packs of beer for you, ma'am. Have a nice, have a nice Easter. What we got, yep, someone showing up here. I had to get these things stocked on on the shelves, which will literally just take us 30 seconds, so... 150.80. Dang. Okay. Look at that. Occupado. There we go, and we got just some potatoes here to go out. You know, like, why can't that just... I don't know. That part doesn't really make sense to me, but that's okay. Let's get these guys all nice and checked out. I mean, it's keeping us busy having the red, running the red, one of the registers and everything too, which is actually really nice. So I'm a-okay -okay with that. We got some kegs of beer. We got some cereal, some cheeses. There you are, sir. We got 121 even for you. There you are, sir. Have a nice afternoon. Or a nice evening, I should say. And we got more people here. Got a couple milks for you, ma'am. Six dollars, six sixty for you. And someone else, cleaner and a flower for you. We got fourteen even for you, sir. Thank you. Appreciate the business. Um, anything else? That, obviously, we got the case of water just sitting there. Anything else? Is that gonna be gotten rid of? Or that's not the right case of water, anyways. What do we have here? We got one that we could fill up. So unfortunately, we aren't able to put this in anyway. So let's grab that, grab that. So we got 16 out of there. Let me top this off real quick with water. And then we can top, put this one in here and grab this one out right here. Oh, actually, you know what? I need to pull that one off. And I might not even be able to now because of the freaking mechanics. Yeah, we're not going to be able to. <sighs> and we got somebody at the checkout, and I can't even... Eh. Okay, we're just going to leave that sitting right there temporarily. Holy crap. How much stuff do you have there, sir? Appreciate the business, but dang. That has a lot of items. No change back needed. Thank you. Appreciate that. Oh, we got a couple of large sushis. We got some vodka, some fries. 129.60. That is crazy for you, ma'am. We got a little over 10 grand already, so that is awesome. Uh, we need to sell through a couple more waters, which we got another one there already, so that's good. We got someone waiting at the checkout. I'm gonna help them out, I guess. Help you out, ma'am. Look at all this. That is insane. All right, we got zero dollars back for you. Okay. Oh my jeez. Okay. Got a few more waters that we need to sell through. Three more. Get that emptied out and where that needs to be. We got 42 back for you and change. There you are, sir. Have a nice evening. Like, look at how many people we still have in the store. We've been at 9 o'clock for a long time. So that is actually insane. That we are, have that many people in the store at this point in time. Got some vodkas that we need. Some kegs, some mayos, hot sauce. Got some bottled water. Got some coffee, got some sushis, potatoes, uh, some shampoo, some hand soap, dishwasher tablets, chocolate bars, got some milks, more milks, teas, and there we go. Got 27 items in our cart just waiting for us to sell, or waiting for us to purchase. Thirteen fifty for you, ma'am. Have a nice evening. This is insane. The store is just popping off. This is crazy. Okay. Um. Yeah. I mean, we're we're sitting pretty damn good right now, so I'm really happy with this. And get rid of some of these milks that we're gonna need to actually to make some room for our new milk that we're getting. There's that. Tea. Great. Nope. Okay. All right, yeah, we're. I mean, we're sitting pretty good, honestly. Where are we at with our um, hiring here? 
we're at exactly a thousand, so we need 750 more checkouts to uh, complete that. So definitely enough, but uh, I guess that if we were to run every customer through us, that would take about 10 days. It's about 70, average of 70 customers, anywhere between like mid 60s and mid 70s we get, so an average of 70 at that point. So yeah, we need a lot of customers still come through our checkouts. But that's alright. It's going to take... I mean, we're at, actually, we're at level 50 now at that point. So we technically have a high enough level to get to hire a fourth cashier. We just don't have the space yet. But we're not far off from it. I think once we get the next expansion, we can easily do like a 2x2 two two setup like I was talking about. Maybe moving the freezer over or something like that. I don't know. We will see at that point. But we got two more people coming through here. Alright, Timmy. Could you, could you like speed it up, please? <laughs> okay. Yeah, I mean, we're like I said, we're sitting pretty good, honestly. Definitely could be worse, worse off for sure. We just need to finish off this day here, and then keep on stocking stuff up here. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> That's all it is. Come on, Timmy. You've seen how I just fly through customers. What are you doing? Speed it up, please. <laughs> We're waiting on you. It's like probably after midnight at this point with how, how much time has passed. Past nine. Okay. There we go. Let's see. how many, We had 76 again, so that's a good, really good customer amount. We made some good money. Brown sugar is going down. Going down, down, down. Oh, well, that really dropped. Okay, we're going to go with 7 bucks on that. And I'm going to place this order real quick. And then we are going to keep on stocking stuff up. Holy crap, look at that. <laughs> and just like that, we're able to stock like pretty much all of it up, though. So that is just... Oh, I love it. So cool. We're able to just go through 27 boxes, basically. 26, and we'll be able to get this one out right now. And there we go. That is that. So just like that, our storage room is already almost stocked up. When we just would have spent like a half hour on that normally. Stock all that up. But that's going to be it for this episode, guys. So if you guys did enjoy this, be sure to smash that like button. Show what some love and support. If you guys are new around here, check this out. Be sure to hit that subscribe button down below so you guys don't miss out on any videos. But uh, thank you all very much for watching. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. Let me know in the comments what you guys think of the mods. If you guys want to see some more of them or see less of them. I'm not too sure what you guys think of them quite yet, but I really hope you enjoy them because I'm definitely enjoying them. So thank you very much. See you guys all next time. Peace out.